Question number 8. In countries like USA and Canada, temperature is measured in Fahrenheit. Whereas, in countries like India, it is measured in Celsius. Here a linear equation that converts Fahrenheit to Celsius. F is equal to 9 upon 5 into C plus 32. First option. Draw the graph of the linear equation above using Celsius for x-axis and Fahrenheit for y-axis. That means you have to draw the graph for this equation in that x-axis you have to take Celsius and y-axis you have to take Fahrenheit. Okay. To draw the graph, I need two points, coordinate points. Then only you can draw the line equation I already told you. So, okay. F and C, I have to mark it here. Okay. I'm keeping C value is 0 here. What will happen? Write it here. If C equal to 0 in equation number 1, what will happen? Tell me. 9 by 5 into 0 plus 32 which is equal to what f 9 by 5 into 0 will be 0 0 plus 32 is what 32 so f value is what 32 okay the same way another one i am telling you the other one keeping the c value is 5 suppose i am keeping the c value is 5 what will happen for f f equal to 9 by 5 into C place I am going to keep 5 plus 32. 5 and 5 is cancelled here. 9 plus 32 that is 41. So in F place I am going to write 41. I got two coordinate points so that we can draw the graph of this linear equation. So let us see. To draw the figure I have to draw x axis and y axis. This is 0. First check the x and y they already told you Celsius you have to take in x-axis, Fahrenheit you have to take it in y-axis. So x-axis what is the value? 0 and 5. 0 and 5 is there so I can take 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 I can take in x-axis. y-axis you check the values 32 and 41. So we can take 10, 20, 30 like that. 10, 20, 30, 40. 50 like that I have taken in y axis. Let us see now. 0, 32 because x axis first we have to write. So 0, 32 here 5, 41. Why I have taken like this? Because this is I have taken in x axis. That's why 0, 32. So take it here 0, 32 what will happen? 0 and 32. 30, 31, 32. It will be here. Okay. Here 5, 41, 5 in x-axis, 41 in y-axis. See, 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 see. So join these two points. You will get the line equation line. Okay, that's all. Second part. If the temperature is 30 degree Celsius, what is the temperature in Fahrenheit? That means... Celsius temperature is given to you. They are asking you about Fahrenheit. So by using this formula, I am going to find out Fahrenheit value. So F is equal to 9 upon 5 into Celsius temperature is already given to you. That is 30 degree. So 30 plus 32. So 5 and 30, it comes 6 times. 9 is 54 plus 32. So your answer is 86. Fahrenheit is 86 degree temperature. Okay. That's all. Third. If the temperature is 95 degree Fahrenheit. What is the temperature in Celsius? Here Fahrenheit temperature is given to you. That is 95 degree Fahrenheit. And asking about the Celsius. Keep this Fahrenheit temperature in this equation. Then you will get the Celsius temperature. So, 95 which is equal to 9 upon 5 into C plus 32. Yes, plus 32 on this side minus 32. So, 95 minus 32 which is equal to 9 upon 5 into C. Why I have taken this plus 32 on this side minus 32? Because these are in multiplication. So, I want able to shift this 9 upon 5 this side. First, I have to bring that simple value. 
Okay, that's why plus 32 comes this side minus 32. So our answer is this is 3 and this is what? 6 which is equal to 9 upon 5 into C. 9 and 63, 7 times it will go. Divided by 5, come this side, multiplied by 5. 7 into 5, that is 35 degree, which is equal to Celsius. Celsius temperature is 35 degree. If the temperature is 0 degree Celsius, what is the temperature in Fahrenheit? And if the temperature is 0 degree Fahrenheit, what is the temperature in Celsius? So, okay, in the first part it is given here, 0 degree Celsius, then you have to find out Fahrenheit. The same way you have to keep, a, keep the Celsius value in this equation. Just keep that Fahrenheit which is equal to 9 by 5 into Celsius is how much? 0 degree. So, 0 plus 32. 9 upon 5 into 0 will be 0 plus 32 which is equal to 32 degree. Fahrenheit is how much? 32 degree. Go for option number 2 here. That is... Fahrenheit is 0 degree, then what will be the Celsius? Again, keep this in the formula. Fahrenheit is 0, which is equal to 9 upon 5 into C plus 32. Plus 32 on this side, minus 32. So, minus 32, which is equal to 9 upon 5 into C. Yes? This divided by 5 on this side, multiplied by 5. So, minus 32 into 5 which is equal to 9c. This multiplied by 9 come this side divided by 9. So minus 32 into 5 upon 9 which is equal to c. Okay. Then multiply this one. So minus 160 upon 9 degree which is equal to c. When you divide this value you will get some Point decimal values that also you can write otherwise keep it as it is that is also right answer question number eight fifth part is there a temperature which is numerically the same in both fahrenheit and celsius if yes find it that means they are telling that in this question fahrenheit and celsius both are same if it is same find the value that is your question let us see now in the question it is already given to you this Fahrenheit and Celsius both are same value. So I am taking it let Fahrenheit is equal to Celsius is equal to x degree I am taking. Okay. So keep that in a place of Fahrenheit x is equal to 9 upon 5 in the Celsius place also x plus 32. Yes bring the x value one side and numbers one side. And let us see this. Plus x goes that side minus x. So 9 upon 5x minus x which is equal to plus 32 come this side minus 32. Understand? So take the LCM here. What will be there? 9x minus 5x. See multiply this one it will come minus 5x upon 5 which is equal to minus 32. See 4x upon 5 which is equal to minus 32. Then you can get, see, 4 and minus 32, it will cut and give you minus 8. So, x is equal to minus 8 into 5, that is minus 40. So, minus 40 degree. That means Fahrenheit and Celsius both are equal at minus 40 degree temperature. Thank you.